Hello YouTube, it is Chris here, and in today's episode we're going to be discussing my Wave 5 massive gear update. So stick with me. Welcome back everybody and thank you for sticking with me. Like I said in today's episode, we're going to be going over my Wave 5 gear update, which includes Battle Box as always every single month. We have some awesome knives, we have my Viking Axe orders, and if you want to know more about those, you can definitely check my Etsy store down in the description box below. I'm not going to talk about these too much. What you see before you right there is my old tripod. This is what I was using for my channel for a very long time, and the tripod you don't see which is what's coming up right now that, you know, in my clip footage. Uh, I'm using that camera, but it's a brand new camera by Panton, and this is a professional camera rig that they sent in for review. You're gonna see a full review on this because they did send this in, they did not have to do that. And it's a massive upgrade for my channel, giving me a lot more professional options and a lot more camera footage for you guys, so. But I don't wanna hop on that, let's jump straight to the gear. All right, so the first piece of gear we're gonna get out of the way is my new anchor battery for my channel. This is the 26,800 mAh or milliamp battery. This is the new one with the three charge ports and the two input ports so I can actually charge this thing a lot faster, which is a huge godsend. Um, I don't know if they're still on sale, but I found this on sale for about $56. They usually go for about 80 on Amazon, so if you want one of these, I'll definitely plug a, a link in the description box below. And as always, for anybody who does shop on the Amazon links that I post down in the description box below, it does help support our channel and help us keep doing what we're doing. But that's not the main focus of it. You're going to see a huge review on that soon. I'm extraordinarily happy with that uh, Extended Life battery so far. Next up is this beauty right here. This is the Tactical Tonto by Stonehaven Knifeworks, my good buddy. Uh, Tobin Nieto, the Fortune Fire Champion, same guy who did the Viking Sax video. And one of the same houses you see me when you see me on my update photos on social media uh, when I go to the Forge and work on my backing axe orders. Now, it's no surprise for someone who has a channel that I have a slightly larger social media reach than a guy who busts his ass all day long to make and forge knives. So what I'm going to be doing, this is the official shout out plus the review video I'll be doing for this individually, is I'll actually be selling these uh, for Tobin in my Etsy store. So you're going to see photos and everything and their price are what his prices are. I do not take any of the money for it from him. He gets 100% of the profits. I'm just giving him a slightly larger audience for people to become aware of his stuff until he comes into full glory and he's like, hey, I had to shut down my shop, I can't do it anymore. So until that happens, we're gonna be uh, blessing him and hooking him up and giving him a little bit more exposure. He makes some beautiful stuff. This is hand forged at a single piece of 1084 high carbon steel. Beautiful uh, West Coast Systems epoxy uh, handle wrap with a Turk's head knot. This is just one beastie, huge blade. And if you want more information for that, I'll definitely have this um, link down in the description box below so you can go check out this stuff. Next up, we're gonna talk about Battle Box Mission 23, which is why I know most of you showed up. And um, well, this month is gonna be a little interesting for me. I'm just, like I said, you can see I'm doing my own individual research as always, because I always like to trust and verify. So for me personally, as someone who uh, makes, designs, customizes, and does a lot of um, blade work on my own as a business. I mean, this box was freaking amazing. But for me, I'm a reviewer and I get to check out this stuff in a very different way from you guys. So for me, this was awesome. And if you're a long time subscriber, this box makes a buttload of sense. But for like, if this was like your very first like normal box, this might be a little like, huh? But uh, anyway, I'll get through that, and I understand why they did it for because it's closing out for the second year, and they're moving into the third year, and I got to talk to them, and it made a little bit more sense. But uh, it does come in a slightly smaller box than most of the other months, but enough of that. Let's get to the stuff. So for this month, this is the Pro Plus box. This is absolutely everything that you get in the package. There's the carrying case and all that stuff. We're gonna go everything one by one. So this is the Rusty's Rags uh, knife cleaning kit. 
It has the sheepskin and the famous knife oil and the rags and everything you need to give yourself a good shine. This is a good basic kit. I have actually seen this being used uh, by a few friends in some knife shops, so this is not bad. They have this valued at $19.95, and this is what it comes with. Next up as a part of the basic box is the Marine Tough Cloth. This is a micro bonding oil free shield that will not attract dirt. So basically it helps you clean your blade to get all the oil and uh, fingerprints and dust and all that stuff out. And uh, it's designed for extreme use, salt water and stuff. I know about this stuff. I think these guys are out of Georgia or Florida if I'm not mistaken to be 400% honest. But um, that's a nice cloth and it, this is from the same company. This is also a oil pen that allows you to get inside your um, joints and locking mechanisms and pivots for your folding knives and be able to oil those areas up, especially if you have to worry about something such as ball bearings and they get a little dirty or you have uh, some of those Teflon or phosphor bronze bushings and all that kind of stuff. This will definitely be a rust inhibitor and a lubricant so you can have a smoother action if you're not someone who likes to mod your own knives yourself. Next up is the version one Pocket Pal by Smiths. And I know you guys are no stranger to the Smiths Pocket Pal version two video that I'll link down in the description box below that comes with a ferro rod and a flashlight and all that stuff. But this is just for the basic kit. And this has the coarse and the fine rod, the serrated edges, it's pretty sweet not too bad and the reason why you don't see me taking a lot of this stuff out is because I'm not sure yet but I might end up giving some of this stuff away so I don't want to damage it if I um, end up doing something like that uh, next up in the basic box is the tops knives blade care DVD uh, that's pretty sweet actually for a production company tops knives is one of the absolute best as far as their overall quality I have utmost respect for tops knives and the DVD is kind of cool but in all respect and I get it's totally themed so it makes sense for this particular box but it's not survival or tactical gear and I know a few of you guys watch it I watched the DVD and you will see a couple clips of that and I found it interesting I actually learned a couple things I didn't know and I take care of blades all day long so it was pretty cool to be able to learn some stuff from the professionals I'm not gonna lie I did find value in that so to speak they have that value to $29.95 um, I kind of maybe see it at like 20 bucks, like as a normal DVD price, new release to kind of DVD price, but for smaller releases, they can't, you know, they're not selling hundreds of thousands of these. These are maybe, you know, a few thousand people buy these, so upping the price a little bit, and it's, you know, kind of insider knowledge from professional um, production company, kind of makes a little sense. So, uh, the last item is the ReadyMan Basic Membership Renewal. It says it's free and it's a $10 value. Like I said, I am not in for them. I don't mind them putting that free coupon in there and them sponsoring them and you know getting Ready Man's name out there. But I kind of don't. I don't really. I'm not into the fact that it's included into the the premium membership and that included into the value. I understand it's free and I, it's something they're doing as a promotional thing for Ready Man. But I don't like it added to the box uh, value retail because not a, it's not a tangible physical item, and it may or may not be something I'm even interested in anyway. So having physical gear is what I know a lot of people buy BattleBox for because it is, for lack of a better term for the past few years, been gear porn. All right, next up is this uh, BattleBox brand, apparently, um, Restore Leather Shop. And I don't know why it's a BattleBox brand because I know exactly where this came from. And um, they have this rated at $29.99, but you can find these online for a lot cheaper. These are awesome though, do not get it twisted. Um, as a on the go or final uh, step in the knife care process, or let's say you have some minor blade rolling or some dulling, but you don't have any actual um, edge damage. Sometimes stropping your blade really quick, doing like five or six strokes on either side, um, just stropping the knife back and forth is exactly what it needs to bring it back to true and you're good to go. This is valued at $29.99. I mean, you could find these online for about 10 bucks. So um, I don't know if I 400% agree with that, but it does come with a few extra add-ons that you usually don't see, which is pretty nifty. But I mean, essentially that is the meat and potatoes. That's just the logo ID tag, so to speak. Next up is the knife case. This is pretty cool. They have this valued at $13.99, which I agree with. 
you can find a lot of knife cases for about that price, a little more expensive, a little cheaper as well, but for what you get, I agree with it. You can hold quite a few knives, mostly folders. This is kind of an EDC one. This is something you take when you want to go on a long trip or let's say for if you are a retailer or seller and you're going to a, uh, a show and you want to be able to quickly store a whole bunch of knives safely individually, you can hold like 20, 30 blades. Boom, you're good to go and you keep it in a small carrying case so you minimize your travel time. You got two of these, you got plenty of blades for a show. Next up is Dan's Honing Oil. I actually love Dan's. Um, a lot of my maker friends, when we do whetstone sharpening on blades, our custom blades, we use Dan's whetstones. They have some of the best whetstones on the market. They're awesome. And having the honing oil is cool. And for this box, I would have loved to see them put like the black stone, which is the really smooth stone. It's one of the final grits you go to. It's equivalent to about a thousand grit stone. And that would have been super amazing to for them to include the dance honing oil plus the whetstone that would have been superb i would have been super ecstatic about that because their stones are just absolutely on par but because of the work sharp kit that they threw in for the pro box i kind of understand why they didn't uh put the whetstone in there but it still would have been a pretty cool addition all right next up is the work sharp guided sharpening system i like this system this system is pretty freaking cool and we even Oh, look, looks like I'll be able to open this thing up. So, still in retail packaging, which is, I mean, super. Apologize for the cutting, but it was kind of necessary because I needed to get it out of the package. Now, this reminds me of the field sharpener, but this is a little more in-depth. Uh, it's a little more um, guided, <laughs> I guess, so to speak. But this is a pretty cool system. It's very modular with the different options they give you. They give you a rough stone and a, a fine plate metal plate to go off of, but all you gotta do is unlock it. As you push it to the rear, you pop that in. This piece goes right in here, nestles right down. You do that to lock it in. Bam, you have your next piece and you have a ceramic rod to start doing some honing work. Now, the good thing about this system is the fact that it gives you quite a few options without having to jump up to something really severe like a like a wicked edge or actually using a 2x72 uh, belt grinder with a fine grit belt which is what a lot of the professionals actually use they use a huge belt grinder and they have this particular uh, guided work sharp system valued at $59.95 but realistically I found it on Amazon for $38.95 and all of my independent research I'm going to throw links down in the description box below so you guys can check all of those links to all the items that I found and the prices that I found them at so you guys know I'm not blowing smoke up your butt or trying to, you know, say anything one way or another in any way, shape, or form. And finally, in the Pro Box, they put in the Ready Man Premium Membership Renewal. Again, it's another membership thing because I already have a membership to Battle Box and I joined Battle Box for the gear. Not to get 17,000 different memberships to memberships upon memberships for other subscriptions. You know what I'm saying? Like, I understand what they're doing and it's, it's, it's a cool thing to do in it. But leave it as the coupon like they did with the Welcome Box uh, like a year ago. And this is the home front, which is pretty friggin' sweet. I actually have been eyeballing this blade for a while. I never actually picked it up, but I like the deep carry pocket clip, but this is designed to be like a field strip knife. And what you might say is, what? Why would you take your knife apart? Why would you even want to do that? And typically you wouldn't, but uh, if you have any um, issues or it gets really dirty while you have it on a campsite, and this is for light stuff, like this is a folding knife, you need an actual, fixed bladed camp knife in a camping outdoor situation but basically you put tension here you take that apart and then you use this wheel that's um, hidden and you hold that down and you start taking this off and this will unscrew everything for you and i can feel all that stuff separating and then this knife will essentially come apart this one didn't though. Was that unlocked to begin with? I don't know. That's weird. Aha! Nope. I had it right. So it pops off and it shows you how to put it back together. And it's pretty cool. I like the fact they actually um, give you that option because for me, I like to be able to do things like that and be able to get in there really simply and out in the field, you're not necessarily going to have all the tools and the um, tool sets you have. So in an emergency or it gets really dirty and you feel like cleaning it and you're outdoors, it's kind of cool. 
Uh, they have this knife valued at 150 bucks, but that's not what you, the street price is. You can find the street prices for about 75 bucks. And like I said, I'll throw this down in the description box below so you can check that out as well. I like this knife. It's centered. It's really smooth action. And All right, so I got the knife back together and it comes together pretty easily. Um, I like the blade. It's a good blade shape. Nice drop point design. I like the fuller on there. I like the fact they actually um, had mine to keep the weight down on the blade so it keeps the balance pretty, pretty straightforward. Actually, this blade is kind of fat. It's not too bad. It's right about there. But it's not a heavy blade. It feels about four and a half to five ounces. It's not too bad. I like the deep carry pocket clip. It's about a three and a half inch blade. It's not bad. It's a good knife. I like the fact that I, this is my first folding knife from CRKT from BattleBox, which is pretty freaking sweet. And all in all, with all of my private research that I did, they have the value set at $356.34. Now, I did not include the ReadyMan Premium Memberships because I am only counting tangible items. I'm not gonna count that because I consider that a coupon in my book, but I found everything for $220.21, which is a difference of $70.22, which is probably one of the lower values that I've ever seen come out of BattleBox. And I'm not 4,000% sure why, but it's still a good deal overall and I'm going off Amazon pricing um, from the 220 to 149 that's the value difference for what you pay and what you could find it separately so if you were to pick all of this gear up you would be saving yourself about $22, uh, $70 and 22 cents by going with the subscription service so drop down in the comments and actually let me know your thoughts personally as a knife designer a customizer and a blade maker i love this box personally so for me it was like perfect it actually helped revamp a whole bunch of things that i was wanting and needing to buy so it saved me a whole lot but let me know down in the comments what you thought and as always if you are interested in battle box and you want to kind of um know more about them i'll put a link to their website in the description box below but as always if you enjoyed this video you enjoyed the way i did this review please throw a big thumbs up to this video and as always, share this out for your social media networks. And like I said before, all the Amazon links from Independent Research and all of the gear that I mentioned in this video will be down in the description box below so you can guys go check that out. But that does it for now. I hope you guys have an absolute wonderful day. I'm out. <laughs> you guys thought this video was over, didn't you? It's not. Okay, so I'm going to be doing a little giveaway for you guys. All you have to do to enter into the giveaway is be a subscriber to my channel. You have to leave a comment down in the video. You need to share this video. You need to throw a big thumbs up to this video. And also, don't forget to um, hit the notification buttons if you are a subscriber for all the new videos. And it is something that keeps coming to the pipeline. YouTube keeps sending us emails about them and don't miss this. And I think they're going to start choking off subscriptions so only our avid fans get to watch us up front. And I don't want that to impact um, my growth for you guys or you guys to miss any of those videos. And that's just me shooting straight with you guys. So I'm throwing in the knife carry case, the leather strop, the Topps DVD, the Vulcan Coronado, the Smith Pacapal, and the Dan's Honing Oil as a my thank you to you guys for sticking around and checking out this video. But uh, that just about does it. I hope you guys have an absolutely wonderful day. Um, I will pick a, a winner for this on next Friday. Oh, also, this Sunday, which is in about two days, I'm going to be announcing a winner for the Plasmatic X 2.0 lighter as well, that winner for that giveaway. So, like I said, I'm going to try to do my best to give you guys as many awesome um, goodies and giveaways as I can, as much as I can, as often as I can. But yeah, that's it. Hope you guys have a good one. I'm out.